just want to make sure it's going to the 5D. 20 bucks. That. This ain't even going to work. That's the other crazy part. Dude, this is... I'm not gonna... This is weird as shit, dog. This is fucking weird. Oh, I forgot to change the name. Oh, shit. Wait, hold up. I don't know why that opened. make sure that saves sometimes it doesn't save and when i finish streaming it just like it posts as the last name and i've heard that if you if you stream with like a, fa a false name uh you can get in trouble so that's why i try to change it when i can all right i have so much shit open on my fucking desktop I got my task manager open to watch my GPU. I got OBS open. I got the chat open. And I've got, you know what? I'm going to close the chat. So I'm going to use my laptop. Well, as you can see, and as the stream name says, uh, hopefully my internet does not take a shit um, during the stream. I have not streamed. Well, my internet. Now, I know on Xbox, sometimes it starts to act up. Um, but I've also streamed an hour and a half straight. So, I don't know what's going to happen. Um, where is it? Hold up. Hold the fucking phone. Oh, if you're new here, I'm not PG. Since this is since I've never really streamed Pokemon before, this is a whole this is a whole new thing. But I was thinking yesterday because I was randomizing um, Omega Ruby, and uh, I didn't randomize it the way that I wanted it to. But I still played through it, and then. My dumbass tried to randomize it again, and I didn't randomize it right. So, I have Ultra Sun here. I made sure I had it randomized. And this is going to be something new. It's going to be started. I've never touched this. I know nothing. The only thing I know that we're going to be doing is following Nuzlocke rules. Now, I have been known in the past to not follow Nuzlocke rules. But as of late, when I worked with my Omega Ruby Nuzlocke that I've done by myself, I had tried really hard to try to keep rules under control and i did pretty damn good even if i didn't like it i still kept it good so i'm gonna do the same um i'm gonna try to make this as entertaining as possible and yeah oh shit wait let's see all right yo i should like Plug in my left, my control. <laughs> uh, oh, it's connected to my old phone. Ah, oh, shit. Give me one moment. I'm almost. Done. And I'm gonna check the audio. I'm gonna check the audio. I'm gonna turn up the desktop audio just a tiny bit. Uh, 
Oh, here it is. Turn this back up. So I thought I was all ready when I click stream, start streaming. <laughs> Already wasted like five minutes. Alright. Oh, shit. My controller is not set up. If my controller is not set up, I'm not going to sit here and waste my time. I don't even know what C-Stick is. I tried figuring it out the other day. I couldn't figure it out. Oh, direction pad. That's why I need this. 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 And this. Lit. This. And this. I think we are good to go. We are. Awesome. Alright, I'm happy. I'm happy now. God, there's four types of Japanese. What the fuck? What is this? Is that Chinese? I don't even know. Korean? Korean, probably. Uh, Alright, let's play it in English because, you know. Begin game. Oh Jesus Christ. So I watched my GPU before. I have had it to speed up, I have had it up at 160% speed. I'm at 100% of course. That's what it is normally. Um let's see. Also I'll make a voices for each of characters, just letting you know. And alright, I think that's it. You have a message from Professor Kukui. Oh, shit. Yo, what's up, home dog? Um, also, I have tried everything and anything to figure out why the, um, the game freezes every once in a while. I've messed with all the settings, I've done all the research, and it still freezes. Um, I guess it's just my GPU, but again, it's running perfectly fine right now, so I don't know why. Also, alright. <clears throat> uh, what should I do? Hang on now, give me just a sec. Hey there, good afternoon. So the day is finally coming, you're moving to Alola. Alola is a region made up of several islands. That could be the reason the region is chock full of nothing but rare Pokemon, yeah. There's no shortage of cool Pokemon out here in Lolola either. Such mysterious creatures. Come on, stop backing up. You find them all over. In the grass, in the caves, in the sky, and see, depending on them heaps too. Some of us even battle with them, but we call ourselves Pokemon trainers. Rock up, cutie fly, I'll play with you later, so pull your decks. All right, I gotta ask you some questions about yourself so I can introduce to everybody. All right, what photo should I use? I don't know. It's fucking white as shit. So. Uh, but I'm not. I don't want to have one. I don't know which one I like. Uh, I like probably this one more. Even though that's like blue hair, but whatever. You okay with the one you choose? Yeah. All right, then. I'll spell out your name. Ah, uh, shit. Uh, let's see. 
Oh shit, that's gonna be so sus. Hold up. change the layout. I can't do it like this. Nope, that's too fucked up. Oh, I gotta fix it. Shit. Alright. Oh, what should I be a part of? Okay. I don't feel like making this harder than it needs to be. Oh, I don't have my. Crap. See, you go by Tom, kid. Yep. Yes, sir, I do. Super loud on me. 10-4, good buddy. I let everyone out here know you're on your way. Tomcat. Yeah, this thing that hits you like a truck kick right to the head. Hey, I can't wait to see you in person then, cousin. Ah, shit. Okie dokie. Oh, oh yeah, it's ultra soccer. What the hell? My god, what is this? I forgot I've... By the way, I played, um, I have Ultra Moon's cartridge. Uh, I played to the end. I have not played Ultra Sun, so that's why I chose Sun. Uh, even though it's the same thing. Uh, a couple minor changes. Oh no, she's cornered. Oh my god! Imagine? Imagine taking off like that? Dog, how many more times are you gonna run like shit? <laughs> Three months later. Oh shit. <laughs> what? Damn. Ah, can't you feel the warmth? Our first day spent under the lowland sun. It's so warm and bright here. But that's enough of that. Time to unpack all these boxes. Damn right. Yeah, let's go get Tomcat for me, will you? What the heel? The fact that it took you three months to unpack the boxes. <laughs> Still don't even have them all unpacked. What? Boy, get your ass out of bed. Oh, sleeping in. You're not allowed to sleep in, buddy. Apparently, I have a stuffed Pikachu. <laughs> Polyrath flow. Oh, shit. Rawr. <laughs> Is that a pincer blank? Oh, my God. Or is that a shadow? I don't even know. Oh, I had to move. 
Thank you, Nils. I appreciate the cooperation. It's your new coat rack your mom bought for you. Alright, I know all of this. Well. Um, so yeah, but this is a randomized nuts lot, so I took if I remember correctly, what's randomized is the trainers. The trainers have it was kind of confusing to PK 3DS because I think it was it's a little bit different than the, uh, the regular DS and the randomizer. Uh, but it went up by 1.25, I think. I think that's what I raised it. Um, and while Pokemon are raised by 1.1, everything's randomized, items are randomized, TMs are randomized. I think that's it. It's not gonna be like an extreme randomizer with like move sets and abilities and all that shit. I did that with Omega Ruby. And it, it was fun, but God, it was a pain. All right. You look like a night, weren't you? You ought to be full of energy now. Just look, it's already daytime here. It's completely the opposite of Kanto, but then we were so far away here from Yolola. So Tomcat, are you excited to meet some of the Pokemon? Aw, uh, oh hell yeah. That's right, I want to move hurry up and meet some too. Living in Alola now, the beautiful islands everyone wants to visit. I'm sure the Pokemon living in a place like this must be friendly, right? It might not be a bad idea to go out and see for yourself just how friendly Pokemon here are. Right, Tom Cat? Go and get ready for a bit of exploring. Your bag and hat and things should be hanging on your coat stand in your room. And don't, didn't you leave your cup and other rules on your desk? I already looked at it, Mother. Mom. Mama. Mother G. I already looked at I looked at it. Alright. Hey, let's get fucking dressed. Or we're just gonna put on a hat. Okay, no. Bro, I look like I'm about to go to the beach. <laughs> but again, it is an island, so. I guess that makes sense. Yeah, you look ready for anything. I do? Oh, but even so, Tomcat, try to be careful walking through the tall grass. Still, I have to admit that I'd love to have a new Pokemon around. Why don't you head up out toward Hiki Town and see what you discover in Alola? Sure. Sure, why not? Alright, well... Let me know over here. Oh, that's gonna be so weird. So obviously, I have on working on an Xbox controller. A, B, X, and Y are just the same as the Nintendo's. It's gonna be A, B, X, and Y. Totally forgot. Nintendo's button systems are completely different. So I can't go by hand, uh, like, like, like hand remembrance, remembrance. So you know, B is gonna be that. X is gonna. Press this. Oh shit, I got this hidden. There we go. Uh, oh yeah, let me change this to fast. Everything else should be fine. Um, I'm gonna leave everything on. If my fucking shit starts to act up, I'll turn it off. It's in my bag. Oh, it's just new. Because I picked that shit up, boy. I, I think I'm supposed to go this way? I don't remember. Route one. What are you doing though? The power of science is amazing. You can enjoy a festival with people from around the world without taking a step. Every day is a festival when you can do that. Cool. Cool dog. Something is coming at you from the tall grass. Oh shit! Attack! No, he's gang. No, 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 no. Wait, we can talk about this stuff. <gasps> Wait. Oh shit. Yo, gang, gang, we ganging up on this motherfucker right here. <laughs> Hoot. Bark, bark. Oh Jesus. 
That young goose. Yeah, three on one, boy. Three on one. Better run. Oh, shit. Oh, yeah, starters are randomized, too. Totally. Cool. And static. Static encounters. Yo, hey there, cousin. What's up, homie? Hang on, I know you. You're a Tomcat, right? You okay? I saw you get attacked like that. I was scared spinless. Looks like you did. Though I sure you didn't expect that, yeah. Hey? I didn't think these little fellows would dash out on their own to help save a stranger. But I guess I'm just getting ahead of myself. Welcome to Alolia, the Pokemon Paradise. That's what I'm supposed to be saying. I'm for cool, yeah. The Pokemon Professor. People of Pokemon live and work together here in Alolia too. Don't you ever forget. You can go anywhere, yeah, as long as you got a Pokemon in your corner. Why Pokemon could be looking in the tall grass, yeah, just wait to leap out and bite you. But you'd be fine if you got a partner in your own. Hey there, let me introduce the Pokemon that helped you out. Oh, okay, okay. <sighs> I don't know why I'm yawning. Just the grass type Pokemon Rowlet. Hoot hoot, motherfucker. <laughs> I'm gonna open up my blinds just a little bit so I can get just, just a little bit more light in here. And the fire type Pokemon Lit. And the water type Pokemon Poplio. So, you see, the matter of fact of the matter is, one of these Pokemon will come to first part. Oh, shit. Hey, maybe they wanted to save you. Go on and choose what you'd like to keep, cousin. Alright, so. Starters and randomized. Uh, I was gonna say, I've always went with Poplio, but again, it's randomized, so it doesn't matter. What? <laughs> what is this? Yo, no, imagine I take the Caterpie. All right, let me stop. <laughs> oh, let me keep my Pokedex with me. Let me grab my phone. I use the Data Dex app. It's, app. I, it's saved my ass a number of times if I don't remember shit. Um, fuck, shit, wrong app, dumbass. Where is it? There it is. Gonna make sure I'm in the right game. Alright. I'm gonna have to go with Cynical, because I don't, I mean, I <laughs> Sweet, but like, like bounce wave would be cool because again, it does evolve into Serena, and actually, Serena's a pretty decent mod. It evolves to level 18 to Steeny. and then Cyndaquil. It's more of a bounce rate's more of a defensive mod. Cyndaquil is more especially attack of it's more it's actually a lot faster. Uh, ability is blaze. Alright, I'm gonna ha you know what? I always have problems. Those looks. Someone always has to come up. Fuck me up! Oh hell yeah, that's a sick looking Cyndaquil. <laughs> Cyndaquil works hard, it makes a pretty. <laughs> I'm sure he does, dog. So you want to go with the water type Pokemon Poplio? Uh, sure. Oh hell yeah! Hello, motherfucker. You about to join the squad? You chose Poplio the Quill. 
Oh yeah. Would you like to give Cinequil a nickname? Another thing I'm absolutely asinine about is nicknames. Now, I think I have one for this one, and it's a boy, so I'll make it easier. I'm gonna call it Fuego. There's so many names that a lot of people have used, and I just, like, I just can't think. I never think of anything unique. Um, I try to name it off of movies, but, like, you know, it's hard, dog. Like, movies or shows or whatever. Yes, you went with Poplio. Ooh, what a fine looking team you two are. Now you can have Pokemon battles. You want to be called a Pokemon trainer. Here's a Pokemon for Poplio too. She feel nice and cozy in there. Alright, let's go up to Iki Town, Tom K. Oh yeah, time to meet the Island Kahuna. But what? <laughs> Truth is, the partner Poplio of yours is a gift from the Kahuna, not me. So let's go show it off and say a proper thank you, cousin. May not be the only gift you get. And in case you haven't heard, the Kahunas are all crazy strong Pokemon trainers. Be careful about getting into a battle with one. Oh hell yeah. Let's get it. Iki Town's right through here. Right up and around the corner. Ah shit, oh here we go. Get Poplio there in that Pokeball I gave you. Alright, send the Poplio. Get back in the ball. Get your ass in the ball, boy. Son of a Shuckle. I swear to all things, if I get a fucking Shuckle as my first encounter, I swear to God, I'm gonna kill it, dog. I'm gonna die. I'm gonna weird. I don't wanna be here all day. Oh, fuck me, dude. You got rollout at level 3? Yes. I'm not. That's the one thing I'm just. Nah, I'm not sitting here doing this. No. 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 <laughs> I actually. Shouldn't be going through any other mods. Ooh, there's a Pokeball right there. Alright, I wanna walk through the grass. Got a potion. I thought I randomized these. What the fuck? Did it not randomize? Again. I had so many issues with randomizing items and randomizing TMs on Mega Ruby. It would never save. And I figured out last time I didn't export a certain folder. Which is what I should have done last time. And I did it this time. I thought that might fix it. Kingler. I'm not doing it too. So we got Shuckles and Kingler. Again, I'd rather have them Kingler. Oh. Oh shit. <laughs> this motherfucker. Oh no. Uh. Um. Well, I get a lot of voices from movies, shows, other YouTubers, etc. So, I'm gonna do my best. Oh god. Hey, hey! Which Pokemon are you gonna choose as your partner? Have you decided? Ah, oh, shit. Oh yeah, I'm how. I couldn't wait for us to pick our partners together. So I came to find you myself. Oh, look at that stupid motherfucker right there. Yo, your pop Leah Quill is so cool. Hey, wait, you already picked one. That's cheating. Yo, sorry about that, Hal. We had a little accident on the way here, so I ended up letting Tomcat choose his partner first without you. Fair enough. I guess it was just fit for you guys to meet. But you could choose one of these two, Hal. Aw, oh, shit. Then my partner will be Litten. I choose you. Alola, my friend. We decided ages ago that you're the one I wanted to have an adventure with. 
Kitty, Kitty. <laughs> We're gonna do so much awesome stuff together. Just you wait and see. Professor, you take good care of Rallet, right? You better believe I will, Hal. Oh, yeah. All right, then, Rallet, everybody. Time to get back in your balls for now. Wait up, me and Layton have a fever that. Be our opponents and all. Oh, wait a minute. Hold up. Wait, 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 I'm not healed, dog. Would I? Oh. Hold on, man. Before you two step into the ring, let's make sure little Papio is up to it. Oh, thank God. Woo! I was almost I was sweating for a second. I thought I was going to get my ass handed. Alright, I'm seriously going to enjoy this. Oh, shit. You are challenged by hell. That's not a litten! Holy sh- That's a fucking Metagross! What am I gonna do to this? Oh my god, I'm gonna get slapped! And it's level 6! Oh, we're gonna have so much fun. We're gonna have so much fun, dog. I just got raped. <laughs> Ooh, that was awesome, Tomcat. You and Pop Leo were both so cool. You've got to have the kind of battles where everyone has fun. You and your Pokemon too, you know. Oh, I know, man. I know. Right on, Tomcat. You and Halbo brought up the best in your partners and pulled up some spectacular moves. Yeah. That Kiki Town's right up those stairs. Come on, Tomcat. You should totally check out Iki Town. Alright man, I'm coming though. I'll check out Iki Town. I kinda want that ball. Did he heal me up? Well he did, cause I died. Got my ass slapped. I got destroyed though. Holy shit, dude! A fucking Moltres. Well, I don't have any balls, so I'm gonna try to get as much experience as I can. That's that's what I'm gonna have to work with. We are gonna have to get the most. Da 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 da. -da. Come on, dog. There we go. Now, I'm not gonna try to speed up a whole lot. Bro. Smokescreen. That was some easy leveling up. Do, 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 do. Paralyze here. Um, now, if I enjoy doing this, streaming this, and if it works well, I'll probably go ahead and. Dude, uh, I have done one uh, fan made ROM. That was Dark Rising. Of course, Dark Rising is known as one of the hardest Pokemon games ever created. I beat it. <laughs> Barely. <laughs> but. Uh. Nah, I'm just gonna run. I was thinking about it, and I was like, fuck. Oh, so, so funny. I, I, I'm trying to get levels, because again, I raised up the leveling. And a point plus 1.25. Um, I looked at one thing because I wanted to make sure that the levels were good and Because when the first time I did it, I did it 1.55 because I wasn't I didn't understand it I raised some some bitches up to level 100. I was like fuck that. We are not doing that It was like the first trainer was like a level 11. I was like <laughs> no I... And we're here this right here is Icky Town Aw, oh, shit. This town's where folks come to worship the Pokemon and watch over Melon Melon Island. Zapu Coco keeps us all safe and happy, see? 
You look like the Kahuna is nowhere to be found, though. I guess there must be some trouble somewhere on the island needs fixing, yeah. Yeah, the Kahuna wanted off without a word to anybody. Singing a little ditty or something. A little ditty. Hmm. I'm gonna go stop by home for a sec. I gotta show me mom letting. Yo, I got an idea for you, Tonka. If you head through the village and up the hill, you can visit the ruins that belong at Tapu Koko. That's our island's guardian deity, yeah. Why don't you go and introduce yourself? If you're real lucky, maybe you'll actually get a glimpse of the guardian deity yourself. I'll stick around here wait for you to see if the Kahuna comes back. Okie dokie. <gasps> there's a sticker. So yeah, there's. I know there's something. There's stickers in this game. I was terrible when I played Ultra Moon. As I never played it before, I was ass at getting stickers. I didn't. I did not know where any of them were. I gotta. I gotta pay attention to that this time. Well, it's a struggle. It's both my China and my melee. There must be some trouble going down somewhere on the island. I need to get in this touch. Because he said something about how it's time for old Hala. Hmm. So I think this is where it is. Yes, sir. This is where the beginning of... Oh, this is it. Uh oh. Oh god. I know, I know, I'll take you to the ruins. So please stay in the back, and we could get in trouble if anyone sees you. Aw oh, shit. Someone breaking the law. There's some justice in the Iki town. Uh oh. <laughs> oh no. The fuck? Poofy motherfucker. Oh shit! You got some Spiro. Spiro. Uh oh. That little poof, poofy thing. We gotta save it. But first, I got more important. What? What the fuck do you want? Uh, What's wrong? Help! Save Nebby! <sighs> Nebby, what the fuck are you doing, dog? Pew pew! Ah, fuck that shit up. That sparrow attacking it! But I'm not a traitor, I can't! Oh shit. <laughs> oh, here you post one for you. Well, thank you. I appreciate it. Alright, run, run, run as fast as you can. Oh shit. What the? Hey! What the? A flying meow stick appeared. <laughs> oh boy. <laughs> Let's just tackle it. I like to leer and then tackle just to get that first offense off. Oh Jesus, confusion. How much is that gonna do? That does a lot of damage. But I'm faster, so I think I can do more. I think I can kill it. Oh, that's gonna be close. If she just spans confusion, this close. Unless I use that potion. I really don't wanna have to use it already. Right. It's too early for that shit. That did nothing. Oh, a well, confusion special. What do you imagine lowering my defense? Well... Oh shit! Ah, wait! I was kidding! Ugh, fucking hell. 
I'm already getting my ass handed. Um, oh yeah, so remember, I raised... A, a whole lot of people don't do this. I did it just because I wanted to be able to keep up. Uh, all of the wild Pokemon have also been getting... Uh, wild Pokemon and static Pokemon have had their... Um, have had their uh, level go up by 1.1. The trainers went up by 1.25 so, so I, did, I still wanted to make it tough um and i've never seen anyone raise the levels of wild pokemon so i said screw it why not let's let's try to do something different el fuego level seven boy i didn't look at my net i don't know what my nature is i didn't even look i didn't even look you managed to chase off one of the spear, but look, there's more! Please save Debbie if you can, but be careful! It looks like that attack may have damaged the plant bridge, too! Dude, I can't do that for very long. Whoa. Whoa! 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 Oh shit, I got you, Nebby. I got you, dawg. Ow, what the fuck? I got you, Nebby. Oh, shit, what the fuck? Yo, what the fuck? Ah! <laughs> Damn. Oh, shit! That double coco. Wow. Pew pew. Oh, thank goodness. You tried using your power again, you piece of shit, didn't you? <laughs> oh, Nappy, you know what happened last time you used it. You couldn't move for ages after that. I don't want to see you like that again. No, I shouldn't say that. I'm sorry, Nappy. I knew you were trying to save me that time. I couldn't even help you in return. Pew pew. Oh shit, got some shiny stuff. Pew pew. Pew pew. A sparkling stone? It feels almost warm somehow. Please forgive me. I'm so grateful to you for helping us out in that dangerous spot. Who in the blue hell are you? I mean, I'll take it. Dun, 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 dun. Sparkling stone. Please don't tell anyone about this. About Sin Nebby. It's a, it's a secret, okay? Come on, into the bag, Nebby. Pew pew. Get in the bag, Nebby. I was gonna take a drink, god damn it. Oh, I'm worried you might get attacked again by some wild Pokemon or something. I know it's too much for me to ask, but do you think you can best send us back to town? Fine. Alright, let's go. Come on. I don't got all day. Yeah, yeah! Oh, Tomcat, you already met Lily, huh? She my assistant, yeah! Lily, I thought you were with the Kahuna. Kahuna Hala, he said that he had something to attend to, so he left town on his own. I was just, um, taking a little stroll up my hollow trail while I waited for him to return. And that's how you met our new neighbor, Tomcat, huh? He just got to a lowly yesterday. Help him find his way around, yeah? Wait, I thought it was three months ago. So you're one of the professor's acquaintances. It's nice to meet you. I mean, you could say that. Look, well, who is back? Kahuna Hana's return. Our guardian's chosen one is back. Only one of the strongest Pokemon users in our level. Aw, uh, 
Oh yeah. Oh, is that fucking? Oh shit. <laughs> Have I missed something? There you are, Kahuna Hollow. Was there some kind of trouble? Ah, uh, I just got caught up in the middle of some brawling rock rock that's all. Sorry, Lily. What were you saying before? For some reason, I thought I saw Tapu Koko flying about. Oh, um, yes, Kahuna Hollow. Maybe got attacked by some spear on the plate bridge, and Tom Cat here helped protect it. But the bridge collapsed, and I thought both of them might fall at the bottom of the ravine. And that was when the island's guardian deity swooped in and saved them. Whoa, that ain't something you hear every day. Oh, oh, nobody said to protect us, our double cuckoo with a rather fickle creature. Yet our guardian was moved to save you. Kukui, my boy, I think we have cause to celebrate. Looks like we have a brave and kind new Pokemon trainer in our midst. Oh yeah. I'm glad to meet you, child. I am Hala, the Kahuna of Mele Mele Island. Welcome to Alola. Young Goku had some told me of your coming. I'm glad we got the chance to meet today. Pew pew. What the fuck? <laughs> oh, when did you get out again? I know that Colin and the professor will keep you safe, but you need to get your ass back in that bag and out of sight. It's safer that way. Nebby, well, it seems to have taken a liking to you. I, I I've read that Pokemon like it when you pet them and take care of them. Now. Well, all right. Here's a lovely gift for me to help make today special, Tom. Okay. What is it? Pokedex. We have one. Pokeball. If I got Pokeballs, it starts. Yeah, Pokedex a really high tech kind of tool, yeah. I can automatically record facts about any Pokemon that you need. The new part of Popio is about to rain, so oh yeah. So check it out. This is a trainer passport that I put together for you. Okay. But you got to meet the Kahuna at last. Or you got to meet the Kahuna at least. Ready to head home now, Tom Cat. Fine. You gonna walk me home or something? If you two can work with Harmony, you can go anywhere. I really appreciate what you did. I won't forget you, Papios. Quill. <laughs> oh yeah, Tom Cat. Hold on a sec. Oh, that's how. Oh shit. I gotta, I gotta read the names right. What is it, How Did you forget something? You're seriously asking me that? Who's the one here who forgot to tell anyone before wondering off a little stroll and sing with our word, huh? Hmm. Tell me, Cat. Would you be so kind as to give me a look at that sparkling stone you have here? Yeah, sure, whatever. It's just a stone, right? <laughs> Could it be? To do it isn't that. Mm. You're rescued by Tapu Koko at the bridge. Isn't that what I heard, Tom Cat? Yeah, rescue rescue me. So it even decide it even died, Dean, to give you a stone. Perhaps you are here to Lola, Tom Cat, because this is where you are meant to be. Allow me to borrow this stone for now. Fred not, but return it to you tomorrow evening. You have the makings of a brilliant trainer. I can see the light within you. You must do us the honor of joining in our festival tomorrow. Damn, I'm out of breath doing that shit. Yo, first, I'll make sure you're back home safe and though, Tom Cat. Lily, you two should come with us. Would you want to go losing you twice in one day? You owe that precious Pokemon of yours. Yes, I'll keep an eye on. Pew pew, I'm off. You're not trying to escape the very moment you were told not to run off. Ha 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 ha. Welcome back, Tomcat. What do you think of Kahuna Hollow? 
Oh, and look what you've got with you! Ah, uh, yeah. He came running out to help you? What a sweet little thing. That's right. And it saved you. That's amazing. It must have been fate that you met. The two of you look great together. I feel happier just looking at the pair of you. Oh yeah. Meowth and Cinderpapio. Oh yeah. The next day. What a stunning sunset! Alright, today's the day that I finally unpack. Was that the doorbell? Go see what is Tomcat. Curse. Who in the hell is ringing on my door? Oh shit. Yo, hey there, Tomcat. It's about time we set off for the festival, yeah. But first, I've got something to teach you, yeah. Now that you're a real Pokemon trainer. It's the most basic of all the basics. Come on, it's right one. Have fun at the festival, sweetie. I'm sure you'll have a good time with your new Pokemon, pal. Me and Mouth will be sure to unpack every last box here, you'll see. Mm-hmm. Uh-huh. Don't get Hurry up, cousin. Return your Pokemon and use your agility. Use your agility, boy. Get your ass over here. Oh, yeah, isn't there a sticker over here somewhere? Or am I just high? Shit. Right. Never mind. Oh yeah, yeah over here. So you know that wild Pokemon will sometimes jump at you with the tall grass, yeah. Now that you got Pokemon over there, you can not only fight wild Pokemon, but you can also try to catch them. I'm going to show you how to catch a wild Pokemon, alright? Keep your eyes on the prize. 10-4. What is this? A Grubbin. You should totally one shot this grubbin. Vice grip. Do 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 I swear to god, if I get a fucking grubbin... Dog, if I get a grubbin, that's just gonna be sad. Alright, got myself a grubbin. Wow, Pokemon do it sometimes attack people if they get close. For catching them, they'll join your team, it'll be a great help. And if your Pokemon get all tuckered out, you can always head home and rest up a bit, yeah. Here's some Pokeballs and potions to get you started. All right, and that's like I started. Oh boy, why don't you have a little adventure of your own on the way to Icky Town? Yeah, take good care of Tom Cat, Poplio, Poplio Quill. Um, all right, so I wanted to do this. I want to look. Ooh, what the fuck? So Cinequill has Terrain Extender. Which, yeah, obviously does exactly what it is. It's naive nature. Wow. I mean, I guess that's good because he's more of a specially attack of speedy mon, so he'll be pretty fast. Um, not specially defensive though.
All right. So wait, I have a wait. I'm confused. Hold on. Is that route? Wait. Is oh, son of a bitch. I guess I'm going this way. My first encounter is... Holy sh shit. Okay. I mean... Oh my god, it has Intimidate. Okay. Uh, hey, that's honestly not that bad. I actually would not mind it. I would not mind a Stalin. Oh, we're gonna be here for a hot minute, aren't we? So, I know he's gonna have tackle, and that stunt one's probably gonna hit like a truck. So, I need to be very careful. Oh, shit. Just like that. I don't mind gonna hit like nothing. That's nothing! So, greatest combo ever a stout one and a fucking. <laughs> Ball. Come on, Stoutlin. Come join the squad. Come on, you know you want to join. You know you want to join. Yes, sir. Do, 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 do. Oh, yeah, we're level 8 now. We're gaining them levels. Holy shit, level 9. Right. Oh yeah, so we don't have the experience share yet, so we gotta gotta switch trainer one. It pays no mind to the cold thanks to its long worn coat. Stalin and Lola to look a little uncomfortable. Sure. Now I was thinking of a few names. Um one of them was Marley, or Marley and me. However, I think Marley is a girl name. It's more of a girl name. So... I'm gonna go with Marco. I like Marco. Marco! Marky Marco! Marco! Bennett. Honestly, I'd rather take the style one than a Bennett. Brisk. Oh yeah, what's he holding? A water memory? <laughs> oh, what the fuck? Why did I just do that? I only wanted to get some levels with Marco. I didn't think I didn't think it would have a move. It's probably only have like Screech and Nightshade. It's probably it. It's probably all it's gonna have. I just wanted to get some levels here. Yeah. Yeah. What the fuck? That better be a level five already. Holy shit, dude. That actually doesn't make any sense. I don't know how I leveled up from that. Oh, uh, trainer.
I'm gonna move. Oh yeah, you gotta. Oh god, I hate this. That's so gay. I can't move it in my bag. So I have to go into my bag. That's so fucking stupid. Dude. I'm gonna save real quick before I face her. Yes, sir. Wait, am I leading? All right, I'm gonna lead with. Oh, that's... It's not what I did. I might have to change that. That's gonna annoy the shit out of me. I'm constantly doing them like oh god. Mm -hmm. So you got a drill burr. Level three. Oh yeah, we get the flinch. Let's get it. Let's get, let's get this. Go Caterpie! Imagine. Imagine this guy having a Caterpie. Trial Guy Jimmy. That is not a Caterpie. Oh shit! That's a shiny camera! What the fuck? Alright. Oh yeah, we're getting flinches for days. We're getting flinches for days! Focus energy. Uh, you're just wasting time. Seventy-two. Grab this item. Oh, fucking potion. Up. Why am I getting potions and just potions? Oh shit! No, 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 no. Oh, it's a friendly Pokemon. I know.
crazy. Okie dokie. What? Oh. That's not something sparkling. Oh shit, what's that over there? Hey, battle me! Marco, go to level 8. You're strong, please go away. Well... <clears throat> uh, what are we gonna do here? So this is what they call a festival. It does look like the people are having fun. Not that they should. As though this was any time to celebrate. Oh yeah, I love this song. <laughs> you don't have to try so hard to act like you're not interested, you know? Maybe a festival isn't so bad sometimes. The art measurements are pretty high too. Are they? It is only thanks to the Blinding One that Alola is overflowing with such brilliance. Oh, the Blinding One is left in such a state now, it's dark and unfeeble. We've got to just make sure the planning can shine like it was to again, alright? So let's get started by having a look around. Who the hell are you? You are likewise new to the shores of Alola, a fellow traveler of a distant island. Okie dokie. It's festival time! Oh! The Alola region is made up of our four islands, and each island has its own guardian Pokemon. Our festival today is held to express our thanks to these great Pokemon, guardian deities, for always remaining by our side. Well, we may call it a festival, but it's just this little thing you see here. There may not be many of us, but at least every last of us. Here goes all out. All out? Like AEW all out? <laughs> Ooh, how is he, Tomcat? Man, I thought you'd never make it. Me and little been waiting for ages. Oh, my little metagross. <laughs> Hold on, didn't anyone explain to you about tonight? Oh yeah, right on time. What to what exactly? Pew pew. Well, full powered festival for Pokemon Train. We battle in the name of Tapu Koko, pitting our best moves against one another in friendly competition to please our guardian. Woo. So you two will be taking part in a battle? I don't like seeing Pokemon fight one another since they all can end up getting hurt. But I'll make sure to both watch. To watch you both. <laughs> God. Your Pokemon have fought for you, so show them the same care in return. I don't mean to really heal them for you this time. I'm not ready though. Are you ready? Fuck no. When you feel, come back and challenge me. Dog. I'm only level 9. Like, I'm so underleveled. Especially 
the fact that I could like get absolutely denihilated. I'm not risking that. Oh, a Charmeleon, okay. Hey, well, actually, I would have rather start with a course because I don't need two fire types. Um, that actually would have been a bad idea. A very, very bad idea indeed. Pidgeotto! I'm gonna try to get. I'm gonna try to get to ten. I even speed things up a little bit. I'm not gonna do full. Full speed up. So I am streaming as well. Marini. Marini. Alright. Fight this hoe. Yeah. 10 XP. Great. Holy. Rakion! Holy sh... Why did I just bite it? Why did I just bite it? Is this thing gonna one-shot me? I need to kill this thing. Oh, no, no, no. So I can't when I'm doing this. Oh, hell no, I'm out. I'm out. I'm out. We're not playing games, dog. We're not playing them games, boy. You see a bunch of Congos. Oh, gunk. Wait, I have gotten a different Pokemon every time. Why? Why? <laughs> It doesn't give me like a variety. It just like a variety I can choose from. Like, oh, I know this mod's gonna be here, but uh, I don't know. You missed a bite, Marco. We can't be doing this, dog. I will say one thing. A lot of people don't care about the carrying Pokemon part in this game. I didn't really care at first when I played Ultra Moon. But the fact that when I had them at max parts, and they were missing shit left and right, and they were like, like, dodging moves left and right, and they were just, they were kicking ass. I was like, oh my god. Because I remember I had, so I had a modest, Poi pole, right? Poi pole ain't you know ain't crazy strong. Modest poi pole holding the Eevee light. That thing. I don't understand. It just got crits for days. It was one shotting everything left and right. And by the way, I'm facing an Entei. Holy shit! Do 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 do. do. Alright, what level am I? Level 9. I'm alright, I just need one more level. Jeez. Alright, maybe attack might do more. Oh, it does do more. It one shot. So I knew, but I knew bite wasn't gonna be effective. I just, I thought maybe the more than tackle one. It's whatever.
Oh, shit. Dude, you better, like, two-shot this. Or one-shot it. And then get put to sleep. Uh... <laughs> Alright, I'm level 10. It's one thing I do like doing, though. Wrong one. This is really cool. Yeah, I can do it like this. And not have to walk all the way back. To the mom's house. It's very cool. Didn't even need anything. And it took like two seconds. Alright. I think I'll lead with Fuego. You know what? Fuck it. We're doing it. I'm gonna save first in case it fucks up. Damn. Critting and everything. I might as well tackle do this wheel work. Uh oh, I didn't think you'd have water gun a little too. Okay, whatever. Fuck it, we're going, we're going balls deep. I am so scared right now. You don't even know. For all life, for all life on our islands. And for those who undertake the island challenge with joy in their hearts, we pray for your protection. For them and all many, many. May this Pokemon battle be an offering to our guidance, island's guardian deity, Tapuko. Before you stands our grandson to the Kahuna. Please have fun with this leading. Oh, I thought I was facing How. <laughs> or How. Before him stands Tomcat, one who has met with the Tapu Koko. Yeah, woohoo! Let me stop. What? What a curious little thing, Tapu Koko. Ah, that's just typical. Cynic will take care of my little Tomcat. As long as we both have a good time, then I think we can call it a great battle, eh? Oh, hell yeah. Tomcat, oh, bring forth the power of your Pokemon. Da da da. Alright, we'll, we'll fire it up now. Barboach! You went from a Metagross to a Barb. Alright. Level 7. Alright, that's not too bad. That's not... that's not too bad. I should be able to take this thing out. Thundershock. Thundershock. And the Pare... <laughs> God 
that. I only have one, I can't be doing this all day. If you para me again. Alright. Fuego, you gotta get this thing out of here, dog. Charm? Alright, we're getting out of here. This, I'd say forever. Alright, Marco, I need your help. Until Cynical evolves, it's probably gonna be dog shit. Because one of the problems I played with my Omega Ruby fucking randomizer, all I got was a bunch of shit baby Pokemon. Literally. Um, let's see how much this bike does. Oh, it kills it. Awesome. <laughs> Lit. Fuego grew to level 10 and learned Ember. Finally. Gengar! Oh my god. Well, I got bites, so I don't gotta worry about it. Uh, I don't think this Gengar should get- should hit me. Growl? A growling Gengar. Huh. Still whooped your ass. Critical hit! Bro, get slapped up! Oh my god, I just got 300 XP. Dude, Marco is an ass-whipping machine, bro. I think if I didn't have Marco, I would probably screw. Hooey! Another great battle this year. I bet your Voco collected too. Phew! That was awesome, Tomcat. That was a really great battle. I had a blast fighting you. It, it was a good battle. With this even Tapu Koko. Go, go, go! Oh, you order yourself. Tapu Koko, song of approval. Oh, I nearly forgot. I think it is time you take this, Tomcat. Oh, yeah. Z move. Clever thingy. You slip the ring on your wrist. Your Z Power Ring, a mysterious armband that can draw the power that lies deep within Pokemon. It can bring forth that Z Power. We Kahunas can make Z Power Rings using stones like the sparkling stone that you received from the Tapu Koko. Though you will need to undergo the island challenge and collect Z Crystals for yourself if you wish to draw forth Pokemon Z Power. And yet you have already received that sparkling stone. It seems Tapu Koko took quite a liking to you, or perhaps there's a mission. Really, it's time for you to get out there? Oh, wrong fucking thing. Well, it's time for you to get out there and start your island challenge. If you visit every island, maybe you'll figure out what that mission is. Yeah. Uh, the island challenge? Four islands. You'll travel to each one of the four islands here in the lower region. Island Challenge is about aiming to be the strongest trainer. The Island Champ Island Challenge Champion. Oh yeah. Oh, sounds great, right? I can't wait to have a real adventure. But I'll let I'll let Kahuna Hala explain the details. The Island Challenge, Kokoi Spoka, is a journey to overcome your own limitations. As you travel the far corners of Alula and meet with others along the path. It is the great adventure that children in your lower region embark upon, along with their Pokemon, once they reach 11 years of age. Allow me to give you both the Island Challenge amulets that you will need. Awesome, thanks Tutu. I'm going to make it through the Island Challenge to try to become an Island Challenge champion. There is one for you as well, Tomcat. Please do give the Island Challenge a try. I had some fucking amulet. Oh yeah, doing the island challenge is the best way to really get to know Lola. Tapu Coco is amazing, isn't it? I hope I can meet it again someday. Thank you for saving me. Pew pew. Me too. It saved you as well, didn't it? It left you that sparkling stone. Stranger to this place. 
Suppose it's time we get you kids home, yeah? Nippy, a little is full of all kinds of wonders, isn't it? Fuck out of here, Louie. I'm just that was the most mysterious event. A festival to, to celebrate the drawing forth one's full power. You look like you were enjoying the show. Did you want to take part in the battles too? Don't be silly. We are here to investigate and learn. Even with all our technology, we cannot control the blinding one's light. Thus we are left with no choice but to try to stop it with right force. And yet it seems that the humans of Alola can wield powerful overers. Yeah, what they call that thing, a sea power ring. Its aura readings were off the chart. Do you think that's why they can control auras like that? Alola is definitely an amazing place. Let's go check the next site. Hmm. Honey, I'm home. <laughs> God damn it. Oh, Tomcat, you're back already. I thought you'd want to stay in Akita longer. Especially right after that great battle. Oh, I was just captivated to see my own boy fighting in such perfect sync with his partner. Maybe it would be a good idea for you to try that island challenge thing. It's something you can only do in Alola, right? But right now, I've got a day with my bed. I would... <laughs> my, feet... my feet off at that festival. Nighty night, sweetie. You get some sleep too. Crazy. Oh, if you make me come back outside. God damn it. What beautiful weather. I wonder what today will bring me. A visitor. If it's Kakui, he'll probably let himself in without even waiting for us to open the door. That's burglary! That's intruding! Oh, um, the professor said... Hey there, Lily. We need that new... that great new trainer, woo! So I'm here to show you the way to his Pokemon lab if you'll come with me. It's, um, it's this way. Tomcat. Here, a little pocket money for you. Don't go wasting it on anything too silly. Here's $3,000. <laughs> oh, well done, Tomcat. You're already making friends, aren't you? And what a cute little friend you found. I knew Alola would be a great place for us. We just keep meeting wonderful people here. <laughs> Me well, thank you. My name is Finny. It's very nice to meet you. Looks like it's finally your time to shine, sweet. Enjoy yourself out there with Cyndaquil, and don't be gone too long. I'll be gone as long as I want. You have a very nice mother, don't you? We should get going. I'll show you to the lab. You can reach the professor's lab by treading through the tall grass here. He says he can research moves better when he's so surrounded by Pokemon. Since I'm not a trainer though, I have to rely on using repels all the time. You do know that using repel keeps Pokemon from attacking, right? And, and about Nebby. Oh, I mean, Cosmog. Cosmog seems to be a very rare Pokemon. It came from far, far away. Pew pew. It seems to have a very strange power. It used that power to save me once when I was in danger. But some other people want Cosmog for themselves to use that power. That's why only the Professor go to hunt on other people. I could trust no one about it. Can you keep a secret? Can you not tell anyone about maybe what happened on the bridge, please? Fine. Oh, Tomcat, do you want to know something neat? It's a ledge! You can look, reach the lab without having to go through any patches of tall grass if you jump down from this ledge. Just like this. 
Yep. If you'd like to take a shortcut, I suggest you try to out the ends of lives. I'll see you there. God, you're talking so much. Chill. Shit, what the f Oh yeah, Ruckruff, let's go! Give it every <laughs> Give it everything you got. My body is ready. Woo! <laughs> That's sus, dog. That is That is totally suspect. Ah, uh, there they go again. The, po the Pokemon Research Lab has its own unique charms, I think you might agree. I've actually been imposing on the Professor here for the past three months. I'm not much of an assistant, but at least I could pay him back for letting him stay. Maybe I'd be more help if I were a real Pokemon. This is the most weirdest shit. What the fuck is going on in... Bro, that is some saucy shit right there, dog. The Professor, he never stops researching those. Not even inside the lab itself. Looks like we'll have to patch the roof again. And I just watched his lab coat and finally got it clean too. Now it'll be in shreds. I'm no good at any blows. So we'll just have to buy another new one. We should probably go in before he does any more damage. Well. Bro, what are you doing with this rock rub? <laughs> Yo, hey there, Tonkhead. Thanks for getting me in for me, Lily. Of course. However, I can be a help. I'm supposed to be your assistant, right? Rock Ruff's moves were just so styling, and I was making good progress with my research. Say, Tonkhead, let me see your Pokedex for a second. Yeah. So, what you think of the place? Not bad, right? But, <laughs> that's not why I called you here, yeah, finally arrived. It? What's wrong, Lily? Don't make me do all the talk. See, there's this Pokemon inside your Pokedex called Rotom. Really? Oh, I can tell you about Rotom. It is a peculiar Pokemon with a body made up of something like electricity. It can take my presidents and machines. Yeah, buddy. You know, put that crazy skill that Rotom's to work. It's the next generation of Pokedex. But it's only complete once Rotom has gone into it. Into this body, especially developed for it. A whole new way for people and Pokemon to communicate. And there's only a few of these beauties out in the world so far. And now, if I power up your Pokedex with the parts I just got in. What? Yo, hey now, sorry about that, Rotom. This I surprised you. Rotom. Here, boy, I powered up your favorite decks. Give Tomcat here a helping hand, yeah. <laughs> Won't let me read it. He's already sad. Check it out, Tomcat. You now Rotom can talk right to you. It may take it a little while to get used to its new job, but I'd say Rotom's taking a liking to you. And this will help. And this will help out exactly. Tomcat hasn't been here in Alola too long yet, so I decided to give him a special Rotom Dex to help him navigate around. Nice to meet you, Rotom. You can see where you're headed just by looking at Rotom. If you get a little tap, you can even check out the time map. Uh, Lola! The salty breeze sing to me and brought me out of you. Whoa! Bruh. Is that the loft? That's awesome. 
take it. The professor's been kind enough to let me use it. If you see a person or a Pokemon who needs help, you just help. Right, Tom Cat and Hell. And that's why I'm letting Lily stay up there in the lot. So, Tom Cat, I'm leaving this Rotom Dex in your hands. Rotom, you look after Tom Cat, yeah? So, that's the Rotom Dex there. He's kind of cute. All right then, Tom Cat, you too. How? Get a move on. Okie dokie. To the trainer school. You gotta learn the basics of being a Pokemon trainer through Pokemon Battle. It's a long road to becoming the Island Challenge Champion. It's train school, first step. What about you, Hal? I'm good, I just wanna play with my Pokemon. The Island Challenge! So this is how the people of Alola connect the world around them. And then there's the way that you and Poppy have both chose one another. And now with Photon helping you out as well. Even Nettie likes you. I guess there's something about you that makes Pokemon feel comfortable on our side. Lily, you take care of Tom Care, yeah? Until he gets used to Rotom helping find his way around, right? Alright, so I'm gonna save right here. And after this, I'm gonna start up another stream. This is gonna be the end of part one of our stream. Um, part two, I guess what we'll do is we'll go to the trainer school. And after the trainer school, I do believe that's when you go face Hala. First, Kahuna. So, it's gonna be insane. I know we're gonna get some new encounters. It's gonna be litty titty. I can't wait, and I'm sure that you can't wait either. So, alright. Thank you guys for watching, and I'm gonna go and get what I need to get done.